Hey everyone, Wes Boss here. Um, in my last Flexbox series, what happened is I had a some code that looked like this, where I had all of the colors highlighted, uh, and everyone asked, what's the plugin that you're using? Um, and so what I thought I'd do is just tell you what the plugin is, also show you how I got it set up so you see the colors all the time, rather than just seeing it when you click it. So the plugin is called Color Highlighter. You need to install it from Package Control. So just open up your command palette, type install package, um, and once that pops up, you're going to want to say color highlighter. Mine's not showing up because I already have it installed. If you want to know if you have it installed, you can just open up your command palette and type list packages and then you'll see color highlighter. So when you install it, it should look a little something like this. Uh, once you have it installed, you need to go ahead and restart Sublime Text just because it does some funky stuff uh, by tacking on some code to your theme, that whatever theme that you're using, whatever color scheme. So uh, it's best just to give it a quick restart. Just hit Command Q or uh, File Quit. Uh, and once you've restarted it, um, then we need to go ahead and... So by default, what it will do is it won't show you the colors by default. It will only show you when you actually click the files. Um, but Really, that's not what we want to do. Um, it's great if you can see them without having to click on the, the color itself. Plus, it looks pretty pretty badass. So uh, what you want to do is go to Sublime Text Preferences. If you're on Windows, Preferences isn't located under something called Sublime Text. It's located over here right next to Project. So you go to Preferences, Packages, uh, where do we got Package Settings. You want to go to Color Highlighter. Now, if you open up Settings Default, uh, you're going to see all kinds of uh, really nice different uh, formats that we have here and you can see like this is actually how color highlighter works by default is when you actually click a hex code or RGB or HSL value it will actually highlight it with that color and what we want to do um, is change that so that we see them all the time so again in sublime text you never want to actually edit the default settings file why because that gets overwritten every time this package is updated so don't edit it right in there what you want to do is go back to your preferences and go to package settings, color highlighter, say settings user. And settings user is a package where we can uh, put our own settings in that will overwrite any of the default ones. So all you need to do here is say HA style filled. Um, so if you wanna know what the possible ones are, you can just head over to the color highlighter uh, on GitHub uh, and it will tell you you can do filled, outline, or none. So uh, outline will just show a kind of a little uh, underline on there um, and then filled is actually what we want so uh, give yourself a new object these are just JSON files and in double quotes make sure it's double quotes HA style set to a string of filled um, give that a save and then you have to go back to your CSS your last your style it works on any language you that you write CSS in uh, and make sure that you save it because when you when you write something like uh, background, uh, background blue, it won't highlight until you actually save it and then it will kick it in. So there you go. Once you have that, it should be highlighting them automatically. What's really cool is that it works with your hex codes. It works with RGBA values. Um, you can see that here, if I change this from 0 0.2 opacity to 0 0.9, uh, it will update the actual color of it. And it also works with your SAS, your less, and your stylish variables. So wherever you use them in uh, the document, it will also do that. Um, so that's it. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. I've got a book on Sublime Text if you're interested. It's at sublimetextbook.com. And uh, we use that to just dive into everything Sublime Text has to offer. Um, and you can grab the, the book and you can use the coupon code WESTBOSS, all caps, for 10 binos off. Uh, enjoy. Thanks a lot.